letter to my first baby on his first birthday. I'm patiently waiting for you to arrive. Each day is temporary, fading into the next. And before I know it, my tiny baby who only wants his mama will bloom into a boy, a man, a father. And so today, I will hold you a little longer. It's long past when I should have set you down to sleep on your own in that big crib that's so much colder and scarier than the comfort of my womb, a constant heartbeat wrapping you up. They say you need to learn to sleep on your own, not to spoil a baby, to sleep when the baby sleeps, but I find myself instead staring at your chubby hands, your tiny eyelashes, your growing legs you sleep so soundly, molded into my chest as the night fades into tomorrow, and I find myself aching for yesterday. Each day is vanishing, even the hard ones that seem so long in the moment, even the helpless ones where we both cry for everything and nothing at all. Even the ones that spill over into long nights of extra hugs and bloodshot eyes and frustration from us both. I want nothing more than to sleep, some me time, a shower, but instead I find myself holding you just a little bit longer tonight because there will come a day so soon that I'll never be ready for when you won't need my touch to find your comfort and I ache for yesterday. Each day is such a short moment. I once dreamed of you arriving, and suddenly we got sucked up in the, into the tornado of motherhood where I know I should clean the house, put some makeup on, fold the laundry, change the shirt I've worn for three days, but instead I'll hold you a little bit longer and feel the softness of your skin on mine, smell the new baby scent that fades so quickly because you're changing so quickly every day, and you don't care if my shirt has a stain or if my hair is dirty and in a bun. I hold you a little longer because all of the other stuff will still be there tomorrow, but you will already be so different. I loved you before these fleeting days began, before we ever met. The most unconditional love that no one can put into words, but one that leaves a permanent hole in your heart that will walk outside your body for the rest of your life. A love that you could never understand until you've carried an entire little world inside of you. A love that hurts you to your bones. It all just feels like it was just yesterday. I ache for yesterday, when you needed me just a little bit more than you do today, but that's a part of the journey that I chose, to let you go more and more each day, as each day fades into the next, but I will always wish for more time with you in the days when you fit so perfectly into the mold you once held inside of me, when I was all you needed. So, I will wipe your tears, and read the extra book, and give the extra hug. I'll remind you every day that you can be anything you want to be and to have big dreams because you will grow into them one day. Even though I wish more than anything for you to stay this age forever, where your entire world is inside this house and in my arms, innocent and magical and small. Suddenly there have been so many yesterdays since we met, but I know there will be so many more tomorrows for us to grow together, even if that means letting you go a little more as you grow each day. And every day as you grow older, and you don't look for me anymore to comfort you, don't look for my hand to hold, or wait for me to kiss your cheeks in the morning, I will ache for these days where I held you just a little bit longer, and I'll wish I'd done it more often. There won't be a star in the sky you can't reach. I'll wipe off your tears. You are my world, but I'm just a part of yours. You will do amazing things, and you will be kind, and you'll be brave, and I'll always be in the background to cheer you on, to give you a band-aid when you fail, and to always let you know that no matter where you go and what happens, no matter who lets you down or who you let down, you will always belong right here. I look forward to every tomorrow as you learn new things and discover more and grow your world bigger and bigger, allowing me to be the one to cheer you on, to comfort you, to discipline you, and to be your first home. But I also ache for yesterday deep in my bones. I think I will always because the light in the eyes of a baby is unconditional and magical and innocent and I never want to forget these days. We've now had a whole year of yesterdays together, but we have many more tomorrows to go. So today, I'm gonna hold you just a little bit longer. You belong, you belong. Yeah. You belong, you know I don't know your name. But I can't wait to say it. Oh, man.
amazing, so why am I afraid? We packed up to move and we're painting your room. I can't believe I'll be holding you soon. Safe in my arms when you're finally calm. You belong.